to be the one you Hey friends, it's Charlene. How are you doing? So, does every good Valentine's Day video start with a craft? Yes, it does. <laughs> Two parts flour, one part salt, cup of water. You can make any type of ornament that you want. And you can certainly make hearts, you can make flags, flowers, tags. I mean, it's endless. And for the most part, we all have flour, salt, and water in our homes already. So this cost me nothing. I simply kneaded the dough, let it sit for a while, shaped it out, painted it, added glitter, and voila, I just scattered them all over the house for Valentine's Day. And it looks so adorable, if I say so myself. And y'all know I'm more primitive when it comes to my DIYs. I like everything rustic and looking like it's worn and used. And I found it by the wayside. <laughs> you know, so hey, if you're more particular, you certainly can buy a cookie cutter and, you know, cut them out that way. But I think mine are adorable. One more chance, I swear I'll try my best to always be there. And I want you to know that I'm lost without you. I'm not without you. I hope I can show what you mean to me. Cause I don't know what to do. Next up, I wanted to add a little snack station beverage center to my kitchen table. So I took everything off, and all of this stuff basically came from home goods, except the glass mugs came from Target. I love that um, I saw those in Monica Rose video, and I was like, I gotta have those. So my daughter went to Target and found them for me. went to Michael's and found um, this signage that says blessed and I had this old board in my garage and I put them together so I could put this underneath the TV that's been mounted on the wall in the living room. I just have to decide if I want to paint the letters black or not, but I do like where it is.
Right underneath this spot, I'm going to be putting a vintage dresser that I found on the side of the road years ago that I absolutely love. Never did anything with it, but stuck it in my garage. But I'm glad I didn't paint it because I'm going to leave it the color it is. Just clean it up a bit. So stay tuned for that. Um, it's kind of heavy, so I got to get it upstairs first. Y'all know I always do things in stages because I really need a decor assistant, like someone that will do all the work for me. <laughs> but I don't have that, so I have to do it myself. So, you know, I'll assemble a tray and then I have to sit down, child. I've been tired. <laughs> I don't know how all you YouTubers do it. So anyway, I have to paint this wall where this um, vintage dresser is going to go. And I want to paint the gray wall that I hardly ever show because I don't like that color anymore. So I might do a treatment. And also, I started on my faux brick for my faux fireplace in the living room. So I'll show you that next time. All right, so many things to do. I got to get a rug. I have to finish my floors. Like, I'm out of control, guys. Seriously. Anyway, have a great holiday coming up for Valentine's Day if I don't discuss Valentine's Day, you know, again. And um, stay tuned. Thank you for watching all of my videos. I appreciate y'all. And I will talk to y'all next time.